Hi, uh, welcome to today's solo playing tip. Now, some games are you know, really strong with the whole kind of um, surviving bit where you know you say rather than just you know having rations or um, you know maybe every time you fire a you know, a weapon you have to you know really track the bullets and reloads and it, you know, you know, encumbrance all these things really kind of play a useful part in the game and they make survival missions really important um or uh, they make survival missions really challenging you know if you're on a desert island and literally once your bullets are gone they're gone um then you know counting bullets is going to be important if you're on a, a ship and there's only so many days food and there is no other option of getting food then food becomes really important in other games it's kind of largely irrelevant um you know action heroes you know they fire off bullets you know left right and center no one ever worries about how many bullets are in the magazine because it's a different style of movie and you can have a different style of game and so it really comes down to if you are enjoying tracking food and ammunition and any other you know bandages or whatever and it's adding something to your game then great go for it but if you start doing that and suddenly it becomes kind of irrelevant you know um, maybe there's so much healing magic going around or you've got a cleric that's creating food and water then just, just don't worry about it it's it kind of irrelevant your characters will have so much food you know and and whether you've got you know two arrows or ten arrows you know uh, a skilled fletcher can probably put three broken arrows together and make two good ones out of it so you know, if tracking all that stuff is just kind of um bookkeeping then just let it slide okay thank you for watching